Well, with less than 50 days to go until November's election, a central Kentucky farm wants to give families a break from the noise of divisive national politics. LEX 18's Evelyn Schultz visited Middle Springs Farm in Bourbon County, where their positive message is loud and clear. Wait a minute, I'm talking now. If you don't mind, please. You're going to hear a bunch of lies, and that's not actually a surprising fact. For many Americans, it feels like it's time to turn off the TV and head outside. That's where you'll find the Mankeys at their farm in Paris. Uh, I guess it starts with last year we had a map of Kentucky, and so I guess I had that in my mind already and kind of thought to expand it out into a map of the United States. Justin's corn maze is an annual tradition, but something about 2024 feels different. From the ground, this looks like a regular corn maze, but from the sky, it's an important reminder of a message that can be hard to remember in this divisive election season. Came up with the idea of, of the theme of the maze, which is United We Stand. As guests find their way, the Menkees are also inviting them to reflect on their own stories of unity at different stations in the maze. It's not hard to find uh, examples of, you know, people being decent and kind, strengthening, you know, ties in their community, helping one another out. They hope a visit to the farm this fall is not only fun, but shows people we're more alike than we are different. Maybe it doesn't hurt to have, you know, kind of a reminder that you know, if you go out into the world, you, you log off of, you know, whatever, <laughs> uh, go out into the real world that, uh, you know, there, there's a lot of examples of uh, us being united in other ways outside of, you know, kind of divisive partisan politics. I just think you can kind of step back and spend time with your family and your friends and kind of go back to how it used to be a little bit and think about what really matters. Yes. <laughs> In Bourbon County, Evelyn Schultz, LEX 18 News.